Bruce Berman, and welcome to NFL Countdown from the Bristol Studio. This Sunday morning, it's the 49ers looking for a win. I expect their great route-running wideouts to play a big part in this one. Meeting them, we've got the Colts also aiming for victory. Key for them, a D-line that can control the game. My prediction, San Francisco, because of this man. Three times a pro bowler talking about quarterback Jeff Garcia. Here's a guy that's gone from being undrafted in the NFL to becoming one of the best QBs in the game today. They'll have a full arsenal of weapons alongside him, so we could be in for some fireworks in this one. 49ers, call. Get ready. All right, Chris, from the foot of the Rockies, we welcome you to Invesco Field here at Mile High Stadium. Dan Stevens here to call the action alongside my partner, Peter O'Keefe. And Peter, it seems to me like we're looking at a pretty good matchup in this one. Absolutely, Dan. And this Colts team has really built themselves around playing in this dome. You know, it takes a different kind of a team to really have success on a fast field like this. And this indie ball club takes full advantage of their surroundings. And as the teams get ready below us, who do you think is the guy to watch in this one? Well, I like Chris's pick, but I've got my eye on someone else, too. Garrison Hurst. He's one of those backs that just refuses to go down. He's got so much strength that he can get three, four, or more yards tail. with someone on his back. He'll have a big game. It looks like we're ready to start. Let's go down to the field for the coin toss. It's heads. It's heads. Oh, Jeff Chandler kicking the off. Ref the ref gets 49. the signal, and we're set. It's time for Chandler boots the opening kickoff. Rhodes decides to take it out of the end zone. Jukes! Tackled at the 29. Dominic Rhodes sees an opening in this defense and carries the ball for a good size run back. Well, I'm a little surprised he didn't down it, which automatically would have put the ball on the 20. Well, anytime you can get yardage for doing nothing, that's the part of the game I could really excel in. First the Colts 10, 10, offense takes the field, and they will start at their own 29-yard line. Two's up four yards, and that brings up second down. Second and six. Ball at the Colts, 34-yard line. James gets the call again and will lose about a yard here. The ball carrier. Julian Peterson targeted Julian the ball Peterson carrier early the and didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. Nice job eliminating any forward progress on that play. That will bring up a third and long. Third down and five wide receivers take the field. Well, Dan, we got an empty backfield, five receivers, and the defense is in their dime. Let's watch. Arnold makes a nice catch, and he will be short of the markers. Fourth down coming up. With the tackle. Jimmy Williams made the save, dropping the ball carrier before he could get to the markers. They let the ball Hunter move Smith close to the first, but they could not let Number it pass. 23. That's a great Make job holding them back, Dan. Fourth and short. Smith lines up to punt after the three and out. Smith takes the snap and punts it away. Williams gets it at the 19. Back down at the 27. Jimmy Williams does his part on the punt return. He's going to reel this one in right there and make a decent return. Not the fancy, but it's a good play. The 49ers will start this first play of the drive at their own 27-yard line. First, punches this one left of center and picks up a couple. 
Garrison Hurst was smart to use his blockers there, but the play collapsed pretty fast back there. Not much there. It'll be second down. Second down. Got to take what you can get, Dan, but they were you know, hoping for more. Second down. Eight yards to go. Hurst will get the carry on second down, and Nolan gets back to the line of scrimmage. David Fulton with the tackle. Third down. Brandon Lloyd didn't the have anybody on him, and yet he couldn't make the catch. Third and long, they have a chance, but it's incomplete. Those, Those are the situations where you want someone to step up and make a play. But no one did, and it will now be fourth down. Lafleur gets ready to punt this away. Lafleur gets the ball and punts it away. Walter fields the punt at the 33. Stopped at the 37. Troy Walters got swarmed by the kicking team before he got very far. A nice punt pretty much goes unanswered. The Colts stalled early last drive, and we'll have to wait and see what happens here. They'll start at the 37-yard line. James gets the ball and heads wide right, breaks the tackle. First down hard first. at the 48. That will bring up first down. William Peterson can't seem to bring the ball carrier down until he's run by the markers. He stops him there, but he's got to close faster than that. That's his second tackle so far. James gets the call again and gets past the line. Brought down at the 47. This is just the guy you want in this position. Six feet, 214. This running back comes with all the fixings. He can deke out defenders, spin out tackles, and even run some over. Second and six. Ball at the 47. Brings up third down. Zach Bronson. Edron James high stepped it over the opposition and got the yards. He gets third another and call and he's carried the offense three. on his shoulders for these last three plays. <laughs> hey, until it stops working, there's no reason to look elsewhere. James gets the toss and runs into traffic. Breaks free. First down. Gets first. out at the 33. It will be first down. Edron James got aggressive with the stiff arm there to keep that play going. Four plays in a row, he's taken the low. They are moving through the defense. Hey, there's no reason to give it to anyone else right now. First and ten. Ball at the 33. up six on the play and that will bring up second down face mask number 33 defense five yard penalty from the spot of the foul tony parish Repeat got first some contact on the face mask there but it was iffy i think making it five yards was the right call first and ten ball at the 22 yard line James takes it for his eighth carry and gains about three yards. Second and seven. Ball at the 19. James picks up six on the play, and that will bring up third down. That 
will end the first quarter, That's and the the it's still quarter. a scoreless get it, game. Get it, come on. in motion. James carries this one off this to the right cool. and picks up the first down. Look at the numbers generated on the ground. That is impressive. James will get the carry on first down and choose up about four on the play. Zach Bronson with the tackle. Second down, just a Second single receiver on the field. Ball at the five. Manning rifles this one to the end zone and it's cut for the score. Touchdown, Colts! Nice throw past the D here. Watch this placement. Threads the needle. You can't coach that. He'll get the touchdown, and he does it in style. Beautiful play. Oh. Now the point after, and it's good. There's the signal, and we're ready. Vanderjat booms a beauty here. Williams downs this in the end zone for a touchback. The 49ers bring their offense on the field and will start this drive at their own 20-yard line. Garrison Hurst used the blocking, but this stingy defense didn't give up much at all on that last play. Not much there. It'll be second down. Second Gotta take what you can get, Dan, but they were you know, hoping for more. Garcia really rifles this pass, and the catch is made well past the markers for a first down. Jeff Garcia makes a terrific completion in double coverage here. Wow. Now that is one confident QB. A well-designed play there, Peter, and they will move the chain. First Great execution. Ball at the 49ers, 34-yard line. It in first right side and gets past the markers for a first down. Terrell like Owens had two guys working to break up the pass there, and neither of them can stop him. That's just great receiving skill. First down first with a split ten. backfield. Ball up the 49ers, 48 yard line. Hurst will take the handoff and will gain close Garrison to six. Hurst, the ball carrier. Ball Here, ball. check this out. 11-year man out of Georgia. Actually, this guy's a double major, throwing a Ph.D. from NFL University. What we just saw was a dissertation. Second and four. Ball at the 46-yard line.
first. Barrels off his left guard and yards. gains about three yards. Rob Morris brought down the ball carrier before the markers. There was some gain there, but not enough for the first. That's his second tackle so far. Targeted the ball carrier early and didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. They come up with the big play, and on third and short, they force the fourth down. Yeah, they even caused a loss of yardage. What a time to come up big. Hurst picks up a yard on the play, and they will be short and turn the ball over on down. Idris Bashir just explodes towards the ball carrier. Watch how fast he moves, and then there's the hit that takes him down. Short of the markers, so they'll turn the ball over on downs. They only needed a little oh. bit, but couldn't even get that to convert on fourth down. Just shy that time, Peter. Yeah, a bold call, and they'll boldly turn it over on downs. The Colts are looking for some separation before half. And we'll start this drive at their 42-yard line. Pollard, Manning throws a bullet, and it falls incomplete. The Marcus Pollard had that ball in his hands on that play, and then he just dropped it. Potential for some nice second yards, but 10. it falls incomplete. That will bring up second down. Second down, two wideouts on the field. This one will fall incomplete. Ahmed Plummer did a beautiful the job covering the post here. there. That pass Ahmed never had a chance. On second down, they try for the first, but oh. it's played well by the defense. That 10. will bring up third down. Nice pressure that time. Rips him down in the backfield, and that takes them even farther away from the marker. Fourth down coming up. John Engelberger moved this offense back a few with a great sack in the backfield. You know, that was a great call. They pushed them back even farther, and Peter, could this fourth down get any longer? Well, theoretically, Parker yeah, Smith but it's plenty formation. long enough already. Number Smith lines up to punt after the three and out. Smith takes the long snap and punts it away. Williams fields it at the 22. Pop hard at the 26. Jimmy Williams didn't have much room to work with back there. The special team squad made sure he couldn't respond to that really nice punt. First the 49ers were stopped on fourth down last time out. We'll see what happens as they start this drive at their own 26-yard line. Harrison Hurst used the blocking, but this stingy defense didn't give up much at all on that last play. Not much there. It'll be second, second down. Got to take what you can get, Dan, but they were you know, hoping for more. Second down, two receivers to the left. Streets catches the bullet out left. The 49ers take their first time out. First and ten. Ball at the 49ers, 45 yard line. Right right Garcia throws a bullet to the flat, and it's complete at the Garrison 44. Runs out, and that will stop the clock at 20. Garrison Hurst got wide open and made the easy grab. Great job to take advantage of the D's confusion. They move the ball, and it will be second, second down. Six. Second down, six yards to go. They couldn't connect on this one. Incomplete. 
Eric Johnson had that ball in his hands on that play, and then he just dropped it. That would have set up a very manageable third and short play, Peter, but they couldn't sync up on that one. That's a tough break. Garcia throws a beauty to the right side, and they get the first on third and long. But look at those last year numbers there. That's great production. First game. The 49ers will talk it over and they take their second timeout. the offense a big game here he stays close on the fly route and make sure there's no chance at a completion you can't coach that baby that's incomplete and the defense keeps the points off the board perfectly the played the great quarter. call by the defensive coordinator third down coming up and that'll do it for the first half of this one the Colts are out in front seven to nothing and now let's send you to Chris Berman in our studios in Bristol for the ESPN Halftime Report. Boomer. Thanks, Dan. Welcome, everybody, to the Halftime Update. Let's quickly highlight the key drives so far. The 49ers couldn't get much done on offense with their best effort only moving the ball 40 yards on seven plays. Jeff Garcia couldn't cap off the drive with anything interesting, and time had run out on him. The Colts did get it into the end zone, however, they methodically executed a long string of plays and moved the ball 63 yards on 10 plays. Reggie Wayne finished the drive off with a nice catch for his first TD. And now for my hot at the half player. Reggie Wayne caught the ball when his team needed him to. If he could just continue this performance, he'll have a great shot at going home a winner. Well, that does it from now from the Bristol Studios. Let's go back down to the field with Dan and Peter. Thank you, Boomer. Welcome back to Invesco Field here at Mile High Stadium. The 49ers will receive to start the second half, and this is a tight contest. Currently, they're down seven to nothing. Now, let's oh, get Mike to the game. Kicking the ref the gets post. the signal, and we're set. Vanderjat boots the second half kickoff away. Williams decides to take it out of the end zone. Tackle at the 22. Jimmy Williams got out close to the 20 on that one, so his decision to take it out of the end zone didn't really pay off, but it didn't really hurt him either. The 49ers will start this drive at their own 22-yard line. Hurst takes his 10th carry of the game and maybe picks up one on the play. Garrison Hurst used the blocking, but this stingy defense didn't give up much at all on that last play. Not much there. It'll be second down. Gotta take what you can get, Dan, but they are you know, hoping for more. That one penetrates and stops that back at the 20. David Macklin targeted the ball carrier early didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. That's his third tackle of the game. Third down, empty backfield. Garcia rifles this one hard over the middle, first and the catch is made well past the markers for a first down. High streets was really getting crowded out there with three defenders, but he still made the catch. Third and long, and they get the big play to convert. What do you think of that, Peter? I love it. That's what football is all about, making First the big ten. plays when you need to, and you Ball can't coach that. 36-yard line. Garrison Hurst 
Garrison Hurst stuck close to his blockers, but the play folded quicker than an over-caffeinated origami artist. Second and ten. Ball at the 46 yard line. Garcia gets all of his arm into this pass and is caught at the 48. Finally dropped at the 48. First down. Carol Owens has a guy shadowing him but still manages to make the catch. He beats his man Cole. It's all about staking your turf. That's another medium range catch for him. He's really found his niche in there. Yeah, and unless he starts getting shut down, there's no reason for him to move out of it. First, First down, ten. tight end to the left. Ball to 48 yard line. First gains three yards, and that brings up second down. Second and seventh. Ball at the 45. First gets the call again and searches for a hole. Morris tackles in behind the line of scrimmage. Ron Morris targeted the ball carrier early and didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. Peter, he's been lighting up the defensive side of the ball today and getting some nice numbers out of it. You bet. So far, he's got six tackles. Wow, look at those tackles. That's how you play sideline to sideline. Owens hands the fastball over the middle, and they get the first on third and long. Jeff Garcia has no trouble zinging this one past the secondary. Watch. That kind of accuracy sure makes things easy on the receiver. Great pass, Peter, and he's having a terrific day so ten. far. You bet so Ball far he's three. got 120 yards and no interceptions. First down, and this will be the eighth play of the drive. Hurst picks up a Garrison yard on Hurst. the play, Ball and carrier. that will bring up second down. With the tackle. Second and nine. Ball at the 22 yard line. First catches it in the flat and is at the 15. Dragged down at the 13. First down. First down, 49ers. Garrison Hurst makes the catch, but I really love that great move he made after the nab. Oh, just a little something special, like the mustard you put on your scrambled eggs in the morning. Uh, that First reminds me, I, I won't be able to make it over for breakfast next Sunday. A nice run after the catch, and that's what they expect from him. Heck, that's his job description. You won't see him running a post route, but you will see him make plays off those shorter catches. First, he'll get stopped at the line, and that brings up second down. Second and ten. Ball at the 12-yard line. and gets past the markers for a first down. Let's look at the general here. Fifth-year man out of San Jose State and a nose for coming away with a big play when the chips are down. He's got this job for a reason. He's got the skills to pay the bills. That's the end of the And that'll do quarter. it for the third quarter. The Colts are out in front, seven to nothing. Washington targeted the ball carrier early and didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. Second That's his goal. third tackle of the game. Ball at the two yard line. 
You know, Dan, this might be a nice time to try a little fade to their go-to receiver. Hurst has his number called on second down and heads out right. And Bratsky targeted the ball carrier early and didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. Another good stop by the defense, and that will be two losses in a row. Third down, goal to go. First, large is off right guard and can't convert the third down. It'll be fourth down. called on fourth down and hands wide left he's in for the touchdown Garrison Hurst shows us how to run aggressive in a big big way Oof. <laughs> that's how you do a stiff arm, baby. Peter, that will put a touchdown in his stat column. And that's always nice to have, Dan. So far, he's got 28 yards and one touchdown. Here's the point after, and it's good. There's the signal, and we're ready. Chandler kicks this one away. Allen fields it all the way back at the one. Breaks a tackle. Hammered down at the 33. Ryan Allen is going to take this well-kicked ball off to the races. He found a seam and some blocking, and a few nice moves to boot. Nice return. The Colts have been locked in a defensive struggle so far. They will start this drive at their 33-yard line. will bring up second down. Hey, Dan, look there. Way to pick up yards after the first hit. Wayne catches the heater left sideline and is well past the markers for a first down. Peyton Manning looks a little awkward as he throws off the wrong foot, but he still finds his man. A well-designed play there, Peter, and they will move the chain. Oh, great execution. First down, both wideouts to the right. James picks up about two, and that brings up second down. Complete. Jason Webster was shadowing very closely, close enough that the pass was incomplete. On second down, they try for the first, but it's played well by the defense. That will bring up third down. Nice pressure that time. Arnold goes in motion. This one hard over the middle, and it's tipped. Incomplete. That will bring up fourth down. Zach Bronson came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. Well, the knee holds tight on third and long and forces an incompletion. That was a good call by the defensive coordinator. Oh, it sure was. Perfect D for that situation. And it will bring up fourth down. Smith lines up for the punt. 
Smith gets the snap and punts it away. Williams fields the punt at the 12. And touchdown! Ryan Allen is going to keep his wits about him here and make a smart play. The ball's loose. But now he gains control. Good reflexes to recover from that bad play. They take the lead on that touchdown, Peter, and they have to be happy with their performance on that drive. Yeah, great calls and oh. great execution. Here's the extra point, and it's good. There's the signal, and we're ready. Vanderjat rockets this one deep. Robertson decides to take it out of the end zone. Stop at the 19. Jamal Robertson took it out of the end zone, and while it may have been a little risky, he gets out close to the 20, so it all comes out in the wash on that play. The 49ers offense takes the field and their running game has yet to get on track. We'll see if it happens here as they start at their own 19-yard line. Wilson goes in motion. Round to a halt at the 22. Second down and four wideouts in the game. Bashir tips it away on the coverage, incomplete. Idris Bashir got himself in prime position to bat away that football before the receiver even had a shot at it. On second down, they try for the first, but it's played well by the defense. That will bring up third down. Nice pressure that time. Third down, the clock is stopped at 1.57. Garcia passes this one after the play action, and they get the first on third and long. It looks like we have an injury down on the field, and, uh, well, we'll all hope for the best up here in the booth, and as soon as we hear anything, we'll pass it along to you. Look, Dan, great receiving yards there. That will help your fantasy team. Jordan goes in motion. Slides down and the... The 49ers take their first time up. is made past the markers for a first Pass down. interference, number 29, 29 defense. defense. The penalty is declined. First down with the tight first end, right. Ball at the 49. Streets goes in motion. Yeah. 
Jordan makes a tough catch. The 49ers will take a timeout. That's their second. Second down. The second clock is seven. stopped at 138. Garcia unloads this to the right sideline and it's off incomplete. Tie streets drop the ball so fast there you'd think it bit him on the thumb or something. That's his first drop of the game and while every drop does hurt, you can't throw too much blame on him for that. That would have been a tough catch. Third down, one man down. The 49ers take a timeout. That's their final one. First and ten. Ball to 27. Garcia zings it to the right side, and the catch is made, and the clock continues to wind down. will fall harmlessly to the ground, and it's incomplete. Larry Triplett right against the inside pattern perfectly there. The pass never had a prayer. On second down, they try for the first, but it's played well by the defense. That will bring up third down. Nice pressure that time. Garcia throws a bullet here. And the catch is made at the 11. Runs out, and that will stop the clock at 111. That will obviously bring up the first down. Ty Streets played it smart there, stopping the clock by heading to the sideline. That's a good play. A nice gain, and they easily convert on third down. Yeah, that was a good call. First down, empty back to you. Ball at the seventh. is the incompletion. With the Nicholas Harper couldn't have read that play any better if it was tattooed on the inside of his helmet. That would have been a touchdown, but instead the defense comes up big and forced the incompletion. Second Way to prevent the big play. It'll be second down. Second down. The clock is stopped at 107. Boy goes in motion. Garcia rifles this Touchdown one to the end zone, 49. and it's caught for a touchdown. Jeff Garcia sends a homing missile through two defenders. No room for error. And no room for errors needed. You can't coach that. Peter, the touchdown puts them in prime position to tie this up. Well, all they need to do is knock in the PAT for the tie. The thing is, they could go for two as well, and that would be an interesting call here. Chandler lines up to tie the game. Here's the extra point, and it's good. The ref gets the signal, and we're set. Chandler kicks it off. Allen fields the kickoff at the three. Dodges a tackle, hunted down at the 38. Ryan Allen is going to take this well-kicked ball off to the races. He found a seam and some blocking and a few nice moves to boot. Nice return. The Colts start this drive of the game from well in their own territory and the clock at 58. James gets the call on first down and he's stopped. The clock continues to run.
James is at the 45. Runs out, and that will stop the clock at 31. That will obviously bring up the first down. Edron James got some major yards off a spectacular hurdle back there. Finally, he gets the big run that he's been looking for all game. For the first three quarters, he, well, his stats were very quiet, to say the least. <laughs> Absolutely. In fact, they were so quiet, you could hear crickets chirping when you looked at them. First down with a split backfield. Rhodes will get the handoff and runs into traffic. Tackled and the clock will continue to run. Manning fires this one over the middle and it is not reeled in. Incomplete. Derek Smith did a tremendous job guarding against the post pattern there. Pass was incomplete. On second down, they try for the first, but it's played well by the defense. That will bring up third down. Nice pressure that time. Third down and five wide receivers take the field. Harlow didn't haul that one in, and it falls incomplete. Fourth down coming up. Paul Arnold could have made a big run up the side if he'd made the catch. If. They've been having problems connecting over the middle of the field, and there was more proof of it right there. Yeah, a lot of bodies over the middle, and that congestion is what they're having problems with. Vanderjat boots it from 47 yards out, and they take the lead. Mike Vanderjat really gets the whole ball here, and he needed it. Watch. That's a powerful kick for three points, my friend. When he needs to, he can boot that thing. Late in the game, and they take the lead. That was a very big field goal. As big as they come, Dan. There's the signal, and we're ready. Vanderjat booms a beauty here. Williams decides to take it out of the end zone. Tackled at the 26. Jimmy Williams caught the ball in the end zone and had a big run out of it. Saying no to the touchback was a risk, Dan, but it paid off. The 49ers start this drive of the game from well in their own territory, and the clock at five. Garcia unloads this one to the left, and it's complete at the 41. Finally stopped at the 46. That will obviously bring up the first down. James Jordan makes the catch, but that's not enough for him. He gets it and takes off for more. A beautiful pickup, Peter. Everyone on the offense is happy about that play. Definitely. Great call by the offensive coordinator. And it will be a first down. And that is going to do it for this one. The Colts come out on top 17 to 14. For my partner, Peter O'Keefe, this is Dan Stevens saying goodbye until next time.